traveling through parallel worlds and inheriting a family funeral home. I was thinking about how to expand my business when suddenly I came across a short video. In the video, a man is blowing up a street with a ghost fire on. Ding! The other party will die from dangerous driving tonight. Please pay attention to this customer. After receiving the system prompt, I didn't even think about it and directly followed, and even promoted the funeral one dot stop service in the comments section. Everyone thought the shop owner was here to make fun of it. However, no one expected that the male lead would die that night. This is not over yet. In the following days, Lin Ro followed several netizens one after another, and all the people she had followed without exception hung up. After hitting several people in a row, Lin Rochuan went viral on the internet and became the female, king of hell, in the eyes of countless netizens. Millions of netizens are terrified of Lin Ro, and whenever they come across her videos, they can't help but feel a chill behind her. Even more exaggerated, after being noticed by Lin Ro, he ran away overnight carrying a train. For example, when a celebrity is participating in a variety show, she accidentally discovers that Lin Ro is paying attention to her and immediately begins to explain her future affairs with a crying voice. Dad and Mom, the child is unfilial and cannot provide you with retirement. Novel Keyword I am a funeral anchor, really not guilty. No pop-ups, I'm a funeral anchor, there's really no crime. Download the complete TXT episode, I am a funeral anchor, really not guilty. Latest chapter reading. Chapter 1. Ding. Congratulations on getting the attention of the funeral parlor owner. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 1 Ding. Congratulations on getting the attention of the funeral parlor owner. Sir, this is a noble community, with an upwind and water supply, and an underground CBD as the backyard of life. Nowadays, housing prices across the country are rising. As long as you buy here, there is definitely plenty of room for appreciation. In less than two years, prices will definitely double. Please take a look here. The luxurious mansion with three sides facing north and south, and a double bathroom living room, is currently only sold for 30,000 yuan, ensuring that you live with peace of mind and peace of mind. Get lost. Outside a small shop of less than 100 square meters in Linhai City. Lin Ro is selling something to a middle-aged man in front of her. After her enthusiastic introduction, the man only replied with a rolling word and then left without looking back. Lin Ro didn't say anything, sighed, and then returned to the store. The store has been out of business for half a month now. If this continues, I'm afraid I won't even be able to pay rent this month. The streets were bustling with people, but none of the suitable customers were found. Lin Ro rubbed her slightly sour shoulders and sat on the sofa, beginning to contemplate life. For the past half month, she has almost always gone up to promote business when she sees a passerby who looks like a customer. However, none of the business was successful, and on the contrary, it is often criticized. Being sprayed is also normal. No way who makes her job in this industry a bit special. Yes. Her job is very special. Half a year ago, Lin Ro traveled to this parallel world and inherited this funeral parlor. There are those called Xiongsi, those called funeral homes, and those called by Sherpu. The names are different, but the nature is the same, specifically serving the deceased. The work is also very simple. From selling funeral supplies such as urn boxes to choosing feng shui treasure troves for burial, there is a one-dot-stop service that covers everything related to the funeral industry. As long as you give enough money, you can ensure that you walk gracefully at the funeral. This funeral parlor has been passed down for three generations, and has been operating here since her grandparents. In this generation, only Lin Ro is left as the only daughter, and the funeral parlor is naturally entrusted to her hands. Unfortunately, the funeral industry is under high competition pressure and has many limitations, coupled with the sluggish business in recent years. Since a year ago, 
the operation of funeral parlors has been struggling to make ends meet, sometimes even unable to afford water and electricity bills. In order to attract more customers, Lin Ro was just like before, promoting to others on the roadside. And the treasure land she just promoted, facing north and south with three sides of lighting, has incredibly good feng shui. If it weren't for lack of money, how could Lin Ro sell it at a low price of 30,000 yuan? Unfortunately, the middle-aged man was not discerning and not only did not handle the business, but also cursed and turned around before leaving. This disappointed Lin Ro very much. If we don't receive any more business, I'm afraid we'll really have to go west or north next month. Thinking of this, she opened the short video app on her phone and wanted to see if she could connect with business online. In order to expand the visibility of the store. Lin Ro registered an account on a certain short video platform and posts advertisements every day, hoping to use this to increase her popularity. After opening the software, she originally intended to post some advertisements to see if there were any customers who needed it. As soon as it was opened, various long white legs appeared on the screen. Appreciating beautiful women is never limited by gender. This is not. Lin Ro was immediately immersed in the videos of various beautiful women and had long forgotten about advertising. Happy times always pass by quickly. Unconsciously, half an hour has passed. She habitually swipes her fingers upwards, wanting to watch the next video. What catches the eye is not the long legs of a beautiful woman, but a spiritual young man with the ID, Social Yu Yu Gu. In the video, Social Yu Yu Gu is wearing a red tight-fitting suit with a picture of Wang Zai, dyed with colorful hair, and even tattooed with a large flower arm on his hand. He first shook his flower hand on the roadside. After shaking his flower hand, he rode on a motorcycle that was incredibly windy and flickering with various lights. He tightened the throttle and started racing wildly on the road. Lin Ro has heard of this type of motorcycle. Commonly known as Ghost Fire, it is the favorite of many spiritual youths, and those who ride this type of bike are generally referred to as Ghost Fire Youth. In the video, Social Yu Yu Gu turns the throttle to the maximum and sprints like death. During this period, there were constant suicidal behaviors, such as taking selfies with a phone while cycling and lifting the front of the car. There is also a caption below. Handsome Ghost Fire explodes the street. Those who think handsome will be deducted one. Seeing this, Lin Ro couldn't help but shake her head. Driving in the opposite direction, without a helmet, and constantly making dangerous movements, it's like killing someone. Perhaps only those young people with immature minds would find this street bombing behavior handsome, right? Anyone with a more mature mind will not find this kind of behavior handsome, they will only find it very harsh. From Lin Ro's perspective, if she were to die like this, she wouldn't even take orders. After all, driving at such a fast speed, once a car accident occurs, which funeral parlor is willing to take on such a thankless job? Shaking her head, she felt it was too outrageous and planned to move on to the next video. However, before she could row away, a voice suddenly rang out in her mind. Ding! Suitable host detected, funeral system activated. After the prompt sound comes on. Immediately after, another string of words appeared before his eyes. Customer. Zhao Xinyu, Social Yoyu Brother, Introduction. The customer will explode on the street at midnight tonight, with an accident rate of up to 100%. Level. C.Level customers with a mortality rate of up to 100%. The level is not high but the accident rate is high. The host can pay more attention and strive to receive the target order. Upon hearing the sound and seeing the prompt, Lin Ro immediately reacted. My own system has awakened. And it's also the funeral system related to her work. And the system will give a prompt that, you go from the society, will continue to race in the early hours of tonight, and the accident rate will reach 100%. You should know. According to his driving speed, coupled with not even wearing a helmet, he is almost certain to die in case of an accident. There's not even a chance for rescue. 
Lin Ro immediately felt a bit speechless. She has read many online novels and is well aware that for every traveler, the essential golden finger is the system. It's just that someone else's system is either a divine luxury system or a return rate system. To take a step back, even without a system, at least you have to be a prince or a lady from a wealthy family. But what about myself? Funeral system, what the hell is this thing? The only function is to see when others die. Lin Ro felt a moment of silence. But speechless returned to speechless, the wood is already a ship, and it's no use complaining about things like this. Since we have obtained such a system, we must make good use of it. Due to professional habits, Lin Ro casually typed this line in the comments section. Hello sir, do you need to know more about funeral services? The massive Feng Shui treasure land is currently at a discounted price, and you can also enjoy a 25% discount by making an appointment in advance. You can get one free for one purchase of funeral supplies, and buy more and get more free. After casually promoting my business, Lin Ro seemed to have thought of something and then clicked on the other person's homepage to follow. According to the system, the other party will have an accident in the early hours of tonight, and there is almost no chance of survival in the event of an accident. She also wants to verify whether what the system is telling is true or false. End of this chapter Did Chapter 2 Comments Become Popular? You are listening at NovelFull.audio Did Chapter 2 Comments Become Popular? After following the personal account of Social Yu Yu Gu, Lin Ro originally intended to further study the system and see if there were any other functions. But before she could continue doing anything, a middle-aged woman suddenly walked into the door. After the woman entered the door, she immediately spoke up and said, Xiao Bai, our old man has left. I want to come to you to see him off for the last time. Upon hearing these words, Lin Ro stood up with a snap. She knows a middle-aged woman who is a resident of the neighboring community. And the old man in her mouth is the woman's father. In law, surnamed Wang. Mr. Wang's body was very strong, and he lived to be in his 80s or 90s. He didn't expect to leave immediately. But at his age, leaving would be considered a funeral. Thinking that Mr. Wang's economic conditions are relatively good, Lin Ro is not willing to let go of this big order. If it is successful, the funeral parlor will have expenses for the next few months. Immediately, she put down her phone and greeted the customer with a smile on her face. And it was during Lin Ro's reception of clients. On the other side, in a certain county town, there was a young man in his twenties with colorful dyed hair and large flower arms tattooed on his hands, looking at his phone. As he watched, he was still cursing. Grass. Which bastard left a message under my video? It's really unlucky. The young man's name is Zhao Xinyu, and his online ID is Social Yo Yu Brother. It's the spiritual young man that Lin Ro just came across. After seeing Lin Ro's message, he kept cursing. After dropping out of high school, he learned from others and became a true social person. What I do every day is to bomb the streets bubble girls, and be extremely happy. The so dot called street bombing is actually driving a ghost fire on the road, intentionally causing huge noise to attract the attention of others. And like him, the risk of bombing the streets is particularly high, and a little carelessness can lead to car damage and fatalities. Zhao Xinyu also knows that playing like himself is actually very dangerous. However, he is young and energetic, relying on his fearlessness to blow up the streets every day. He also likes to shoot short videos and post them online. He also knows that his behavior is dangerous. So after seeing Lin Ro's message, I immediately became extremely angry. Lousy shoots a video to blow up the street, and you promote funeral services in the comments section. Isn't this a curse on me to die? The most frustrating thing is that not only Lin Ro, but also others are leaving various comments in the comments section. Driving without even wearing a helmet. This is too long for me, isn't it? Anchor, B.
Be careful when racing, be careful not to let cars ruin people's lives. If my son dares to make such a fuss outside, I'll have to kill him. I suddenly feel that the guy upstairs who runs a funeral parlor has a good eye. He knows that the anchor likes to die and even came here to promote business. Many netizens feel that Lin Ro is quite right. A spiritual young man like this who drives a ghostly fire to commit suicide on the road knows when the car will be destroyed and people will die. Some people are also persuading Zhao Xinyu with kind words, hoping that he won't shoot such racing videos again. Safety is crucial. Seeing the kind comments from netizens. Zhao Xinyu not only showed no gratitude, but also became even more angry. In his opinion, these people are cursing him to death. Especially the owner of the funeral parlor, who came to comment on the promotion of business in the area, is this a curse on himself? With this idea in mind, Zhao Xinyu opened his phone and began typing angrily. CNN, what do you mean by promoting funeral business under Laozi's video? Curse me to death, isn't it? It's really Nima's misfortune. After spraying, he still felt unsatisfied. I put you on top and let my fans criticize you. Zhao Xinyu has over 100,000 fans on the platform because he frequently shoots short videos of street explosions. And these fans, like him, are all spiritual guys. As both spiritual guys, fans will definitely help him speak up. Immediately, he put Lin Ro's comment at the top and wanted to use his fans to criticize Lin Ro online. After finishing all of this, Zhao Xinyu's mood improved a lot. His grandmother, these people are really sick and even say that I drive dangerous. I'm the leader of the explosive street in this area. Is it dangerous or not? Can they still say it? Even those who promote funeral services are so unlucky. After muttering a few more curses in a low voice. Zhao Xinyu finally calmed down and felt much more comfortable. His companions, upon seeing the situation, quickly stepped forward and smiled in agreement. That's not it. Brother you, you're the one who exploded the street in our hearts. Driving so slowly and wearing a helmet, can it still be called explosive street dot? Brother you, don't pay attention to those people. What should we do? Upon hearing this, Zhao Xinyu felt that what he said was very reasonable. That's right. Those people online know the ghost fire of a bird. Driving this kind of car is to be fast, to explode the streets, and to pursue excitement. If you drive slowly and wear a helmet, can it still be called ghost fire? Is Zhao Xinyu still the one who bombed the street? Forget it, don't argue with those low people who don't understand ghostly fire. Zhao Xinyu picked up a cigarette and said casually, All right, let's not get angry with those people online. Tonight, I'll try the newly modified engine and you guys are also ready to run with me. Record a video then, I will use my account to attract traffic and lead you to become popular together. The few people next to them raised their thumbs when they heard this. Someone even approached attentively and took out a lighter to light Zhao Xinyu's fire. Brother Yu is mighty. Zhao Xinyu is the most popular among all their spiritual buddies, with over 100,000 fans. If we can shoot a video together tonight, maybe they can also take the opportunity to make a name for themselves. A few people were instantly excited and eager to go racing now. Upon hearing the sound of, Brother Yu's Majesty, Zhao Xinyu's vanity was greatly satisfied, and his smile grew even stronger. He has modified his ghostly fire and replaced it with a new engine in the past two days. The fastest ordinary ghost fire can run is 90 yards, but after modifying its engine, it can run a full 140 yards. And when starting, it will also make a huge noise, which can attract everyone's attention. You should know. This speed has seriously exceeded the speed limit of the highway, let alone driving on ordinary roads like this. And such a huge noise has seriously violated traffic laws. But Zhao Xinyu doesn't care at all. In his opinion, if he goes to the extreme speed and shoots another video, he will definitely be able to attract a large number of fans. 
He was eagerly anticipating and began preparing for tonight's street bombing event. End of this chapter Chapter 3 The Spiritual Boy Who Dies You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 3 The Spiritual Boy Who Dies and On the Other Side It took a whole afternoon for Lin Ro to discuss the procedures for the aftermath with Mr. Wong's family. She completed everything from the decoration of the morning scene to the feng shui selection of the cemetery. Because it was a joyous funeral, the event was held with a grand ceremony, which could earn around 8,000 yuan. This money may not seem like a lot, but for Lin Ro now, it is already a timely help, enough to sustain the store's expenses for the next few months. After a busy afternoon, when she returned to the store, she collapsed on the sofa without moving. I took out my phone and wanted to order takeout to reward myself. However, just opened the screen. Above the screen, dozens of red dots caught her attention. Hmm. What's going on? After clicking in, various back-end messages immediately caught his attention. 173 users including by Yi Guo Jiang have followed you. You received new likes for the comments below your Yugo video in society. Good guy. Lin Ro didn't expect that her comments on other people's videos would become popular. Can it be said that Yugo realized that his life was not long and planned to prepare for funeral services in advance? Thinking of this, Lin Ro immediately clicked in. The page redirected to the explosive street video. In the video, Zhao Xinyu shook his flower hand twice on the roadside, then rode a motorcycle and started bombing the street. However, the video is not the focus, the key is the comments. After clicking into the comments section, Lin Ro finally understood what had happened. No wonder it's so popular. After spending a lot of time on it, my comments were pushed to the top by others. Below her comment, there are countless netizens leaving comments. Good guy. We've achieved doing in business. Are even the funeral industry engaging in internal competition these days? Landlord, may I ask if the one dot stop service is true, and is it the kind I want? May I ask if you can burn me a handsome male celebrity after I die? Seeing these comments, Lin Ro was immediately amused by the sand sculpture netizens. Of course, in addition to some joking and joking netizens, there are also some energetic guys below who are angry and angry. However, whether it was the sarcastic netizen or the angry spirited young man, Lin Ro didn't take it seriously. She felt a bit helpless. I'm really here to do business, why do you all think I'm joking? But the explanation is also unclear. No matter what she says, netizens will think he is just joking. Lin Ro thought for a moment and continued to leave a comment below. There are millions of roads, safety comes first. Improper driving can bring tears to loved one's eyes. Although she is in the dead man business. But I wouldn't say that in order to do business, I would rather someone else die. Furthermore, she is 108,000 meters away from, you go from the society, and even if she really does business, she cannot reach out to each other. With the idea that saving a person's life is better than building a level 7 pagoda, Lin Ro finally gave a word of advice. Of course. It's not her business whether the other person will listen or not. The two of them couldn't fight each other, and Lin Ro didn't have the spare time to intervene too much. And as the old saying goes, good advice is hard to persuade the ghost to die. If the other party really wants to die, then she has no choice. After leaving another message. She swiped her phone for a while again, and after finishing her takeout, she continued to get busy with things. Just as Lin Ro was busy attending the funeral for Mr. Wong alive. At the same time. In a certain county town, Zhao Xinyu and a group of Fox friends are preparing to carry out a street bombing. They stood on the roadside with colorful ghost fire motorcycles beside them, ready to depart at any time. During the waiting process. Zhao Xinyu and a few people next to him started talking without saying a word. Yuga, just now there was news from Laoli that the traffic police are going to investigate the street bombing tonight. 
why don't we cancel our plan for tonight? One of the spirited guys with green hair said. Upon hearing this, Zhao Xinyu gave the other person a disdainful glance. Lao Li is also a member of their group of energetic young men, and the news is very well informed. He said there will be a strict investigation by traffic police tonight, which means there is a high probability that traffic police will come over. But how could Zhao Xinyu be afraid of this? I saw him grab two pairs of colorful hair and say in a very forced tone, traffic police. Come on, come on. When have you ever been afraid of those things? With my newly modified ghost fire, maybe you can even play a trick on the traffic police. It will definitely become popular when you post it online. After he finished speaking, others around him also joined in. Yuga's words kept pushing and urging him relentlessly. Anyway, it's not them who are risking their lives. Besides, they also want to use Zhao Xinyu to make a name for themselves online. In this situation, it is natural to encourage and agree. The green-haired boy sighed helplessly when he saw no one paying attention to him, but didn't say anything more. That's it. The time quickly arrived at 11.30. Seeing that it was almost time, Zhao Xinyu ordered one of the younger brothers to hold a camera nearby and take photos. He first stood by the roadside, wearing a tight-fitting suit and shook his flower hand. After shaking the flower hand, I rode the ghost fire motorcycle again and prepared to set off. After turning off the throttle, the engine exploded with a loud rumbling sound. A huge noise rang out, and Zhao Xinyu felt as if he had been stimulated by something, and his whole body became excited. The group of little brothers around him, not to mention, kept shouting at Yu Go for his martial prowess, wishing to encourage Zhao Xinyu to start bombing the streets now. That's it. Zhao Xinyu tightened the accelerator, released the brake, and sprinted out like a ghostly fire. While driving, he was still holding his phone in his left hand, constantly taking selfies. There were several other motorcycles following behind, and they also took out their phones and kept shooting. In order to achieve the best video effects, Zhao Xinyu has always used this multi-camera shooting method. But soon, an accident happened. His motorcycle has been newly modified with a new engine, so the speed is very fast. The little brothers behind couldn't catch up and shouted helplessly one by one. Brother Yu, could you drive slowly? We can't keep up. Yes, brother Yu, and driving too fast is not safe. Yuga, wait for us. Upon hearing the cries of his younger brothers coming from behind, Zhao Xinyu not only did not slow down, but also showed a more disdainful smile on his face. Mad, ordinary trash. Can't keep up with this speed. After a low curse. He accelerated again and took out his phone with his left hand to continue filming. While filming, he kept muttering incessantly. Brothers, the ghost fire is exploding on the street. May I ask if you are handsome? End of this chapter. Chapter 4 Lin Ro is on fire. You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 4 Lin Ro is on fire. Zhao Xinyu posed for the camera and took a few shots that he thought were handsome. After finishing the shooting, I tightened the throttle again and the vehicle's speed increased rapidly. At this moment, the group of little brothers around him had already been left far behind. Looking around, there were basically no cars. Seeing this scene, Zhao Xinyu's heart became even more excited, and a sense of superiority arose naturally. At that moment, a girl on the roadside caught his attention. That girl has a beautiful appearance and is still holding a cup of milk tea, talking to another girl next to her. Seeing this scene, Zhao Xinyu immediately couldn't hold back. If I could pursue such a beautiful girl, wouldn't it be like taking off? Immediately, he wanted to engage in some dangerous behavior to attract the girl's attention. In nature, male animals often exhibit various eye-dot-catching behaviors to attract females. The same goes for humans, such as Zhao Xinyu. In order to attract the girl's attention, he also plans to do something. I saw the brakes tightly pressed, the clutch slowly released, 
and the front of the car lifted up. Whistling incessantly in the mouth, hoping to attract the attention of the girl. However, he did not notice. Right in front of me, there is a railing separating the road. The ghost fire charged up directly at a speed of 120 yards. Immediately. Bang. A piercing sound suddenly sounded, and the vehicle collided directly with the railing. The ghost fire completely lost control, while Zhao Xinyu was thrown out on the spot. He was like a tattered ragdoll, spinning in the air a few times and falling in the middle of the road with a snap. Due to inertia, I slid forward for more than 10 meters before finally stopping. All of this may sound long, but in reality it only happens within a few seconds. Looking at the bright red bloodstains on the road, as well as Zhao Xinyu lying on the ground in the distance. The girl drinking milk tea on the roadside was frightened. Ah 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 ah. The next morning. The scene of the car accident has been surrounded by yellow warning lines. The traffic police have investigated the accident scene and were very helpless after learning about the process. At such an advanced age, why not go and bomb the streets to die? To alert other mentally challenged individuals. The traffic police brigade posted a news announcement online. At around midnight last night, there was a 17.year.old young man named Xiao Xinyu on Jifang West Road who, without wearing safety measures, exploded and raced on the street. In the end, due to the vehicle being modified at too fast a speed, it collided with a nearby guardrail, and the young man died on the spot. It is reported that the young man intentionally engaged in dangerous behavior in order to attract the attention of girls on the street. I hereby appeal to the general public that life is priceless, and please do not joke about your own and others' safety. When this news is broadcasted. At first, netizens who saw the news thought it was nothing. Every year, there are always a few people who are not afraid of death, racing to death on the road. And without taking any safety measures, it's just right if an accident happens. But soon, some netizens realized that something was wrong. Jifong West Road, with a house in its name, still likes to bomb the streets. How do you feel so familiar? Immediately, someone ran to the bottom of the video of Social Yu Yu Gu and started leaving messages to inquire. Brother Yu, someone had an accident last night, shouldn't it be you? The perpetrator died on the spot. If it weren't for Social Yu Yu Gu, he would definitely clarify it in the comment section. However, a full half hour passed. Yu Yu Gu in society still hasn't stepped forward to respond. More than an hour has passed, but there is still no response. Now, all the spirited guys are frying pan. Damn it, isn't it Yu Gu who had an accident last night? Yu Gu is really dead. The location, age, and vehicles are all aligned, and it's 100% UGE's fault. It's a pity to leave at a young age. What's wrong with going to bomb the street? You deserve it. Many spirited young men began to feel regretful. And this news also quickly spread. Gradually, more and more people learned about the news of the You Go In Society incident. His personal account also gained a large number of fans in a short period of time. Of course, most of those fans come to eat melons and watch movies, and there are not many people who truly regret it. Half a day has passed, and the number of fans on the account has reached 300,000. If it had been before, Zhao Xinyu would have been extremely happy. What is he filming so many street bombing videos for? Isn't it just because I want to be popular? Now, he is indeed popular, but the way he goes too far is definitely not the kind he hopes for. In this situation, naturally many netizens will click on Zhao Xinyu's homepage and curiously watch his videos before his death. After watching his suicide video of bombing the street, people feel even more that this kind of person deserves what happened. But suddenly, a comment in a certain video caught the attention of all viewers. Hello sir, do you need to know more about funeral services? The massive Feng Shui treasure land is currently at a discounted price, and you can also enjoy a 25% discount by making an appointment in advance. 
you can get one free for one purchase of funeral supplies, and buy more and get more free. This comment is exactly what Lin Ro left earlier. It wasn't much at first. Can you check the message time? Yesterday afternoon at 4.30 p.m. Suddenly, everyone felt a tingling sensation on their scalp. What's the situation? Yesterday afternoon, I left a message to promote business, and that night, the person left. Sleeping slot. It's too scary. I used to hear from the elderly in our village that those who engage in white dot collar business may have some crooked ways, isn't it true? Zhao Xinyu shouldn't have been sent away by her, right? A terrifying idea immediately surfaced in the hearts of all netizens. How could there be such a coincidence in the world? Leave a message in the afternoon and leave at night. And the person who left the message is still a boss who runs a white dot collar business. Hush. For a moment, this comment went viral, with countless likes and replies. Similarly, Lin Ro also became popular. Many people were attracted by her comment, and many followed her and became her fans. End of this chapter. Chapter 5 The internet is booming, is Yuga really dead? You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 5 The internet is booming, is Yuga really dead? That night, Lin Ro and Zhao Xinyu, who passed away unexpectedly, attracted the attention of countless netizens. The fans on Lin Ro's account have also gone crazy and started to rise. However, as the initiator of the matter, Lin Ro was unaware of anything. When the whole internet was boiling, she slept incredibly peacefully. The next morning, Lin Ro slept until she woke up naturally, stretched comfortably, and then got up from the bed. After a simple wash and breakfast, she changed into casual clothes and started exercising outside. Perhaps due to work reasons, I have seen too many cases of birth, aging, illness, and death in my daily life. This made Lin Ro aware of the importance of health and also helped her develop a good habit of morning running. The place of residence is not far from the funeral parlor, and it took me half an hour to get there. Tidied up the messy storefront. After handling all the trivial matters, Lin Ro collapsed on the sofa, panting heavily. Ha when you have money, make sure to hire two employees over. The storefront is not large, only about 100 square meters. But although sparrows are small and have all five organs, they have everything in the store, so packing them up is not an easy task. Doing these things is hundreds of times more tiring than running in the morning. Even if you're tired, it's still troublesome. So Lin Ro also began to consider hiring two salespeople to work in the future. If she had the money, it would be even better if she could expand her storefront further of course, these goals are still too far away for her at present. Now we have to pay the monthly rent on schedule, so let's talk about those things later. There's not much business in the early morning. Lin Ruzhuo began to brush her phone comfortably. After opening the short video software. Suddenly, she felt a little surprised in her heart. Ping and Shifu gave you a like. I gave you a thumbs up for being the most handsome in the whole sheep village. I like watermelon. User 89797 gave you a like. Take another swipe down. Add 19642 new fans. Added 34750 likes. Lin Ro was a bit dumbfounded. Overnight, I added over 30,000 likes to my comments. And the number of fans has also increased by over 20,000. Good guy. You can't scare people to death by saying this. She had a female roommate during her college years who was very good. Looking. After graduation, she became an online anchor. I heard that on the birthday of his female roommate, Big Brother on the list received 200,000 gifts and gained 10,000 followers. A full 200,000 gifts. Plus, the female roommate looks good, and the live broadcast content is also very interesting in this case, he only gained about 10,000 fans. And what about myself? I didn't do anything and gained 20,000 followers overnight. 
no one would believe it if I said it out loud. But Lin Ro is not foolish either. She knew that there must be a reason for the sudden surge in fans. Curiously click on the backend message. She wants to see what she posted and was liked by more than 30,000 people. What caught the eye was still the familiar flower shaking hand of Society Yu Yu Gu, and under his comment section, Lin Ro's top comment received countless likes and replies. Is this the funeral parlor owner who is determined by life and death? Hush. It's so terrifying. The things in the novel are actually true. Is there really any supernatural ability in the world, otherwise how could a comment make someone die? It's too scary. Look at her profile, it seems that the owner of the funeral parlor is still a little sister. That would be even more terrifying. My mother has always told me since I was young that the more beautiful a woman is, the more vicious her heart is. It's true. Ha ha ha, in the reply below. Someone was shocked by Lin Rose prophecy. Some people are also jokingly looking for fun. Of course, many people still feel that things are just simple coincidences. Isn't it normal for a street bombing teenager like Zhao Xinyu to ride a ghost fire motorcycle and die on the street every day? Just before he had an accident, a funeral parlor owner happened to leave a message below. Well, that's right. Everything is a coincidence. But no matter what netizens think, Lin Ro is indeed on the rise, she is truly on the rise. After seeing these replies, Lin Ro also roughly understood what had happened. She opened the news app and wanted to view relevant information. Quickly, she found the news she wanted to see in the top 10 trending news apps. A young man who bombed the street died on the street and unexpectedly had an accident. The transportation department reminds you that life only comes once, do not joke about life in the news, it was about how Zhao Xinyu had an accident while bombing the street. After a rough look, I have a rough idea. Lin Ro's spine felt a chill, and she felt even greater shock in her heart. Everything is exactly the same as the description of the system. That is to say, she has indeed obtained a genuine system. Although the funeral system may seem strange, at least it has a significant impact. After closing the software, Lin Ro leaned against the sofa, her mood still unable to calm down. That, socially yo yo brother, who likes to bomb the streets to death actually died like this, and it's no different from what the system describes. As a funeral parlor owner, she has long been accustomed to things like death. Moreover, the other party did it themselves, which made Lin Ro feel even less sympathetic. The main reason why she felt so shocked was still due to the other party's way of death. Whether it is the method, location, or time of death, they are all exactly the same as the system's introduction. So, if I make good use of the system, can I really have the ability to control life and death? Thinking of this, she couldn't help but curl a curve at the corner of her mouth at this moment. The system page suddenly appears, and the prompt sound sounds again. Ding! Customer death detected. Has the host taken on this business? Seeing this question, Lin Ro didn't want to directly choose no. The reason is very simple. Firstly, she and the deceased were not from the same city, separated by more than 2,000 kilometers, and by the time they arrived, they were probably already over seven. Secondly, in such a serious accident, the death toll is probably unbearable. Taking on this kind of business is obviously a thankless task. To put it bluntly, the world is so big, and every day there are people who die of old age, illness, and death. Why bother grabbing a wool to collect it? Perhaps this sounds very inhumane. But for Lin Ro, who has seen many deaths for a long time, this is indeed a fact. After selecting no, the system prompt popped up again. According to the system, as long as you receive business from the target customer, you can receive generous rewards. As for the reward level, it is determined based on the customer's level. The higher the level, the better the reward. After thinking about this, Lin Ro opened the short video software again and wanted to check if there were any customers worth paying attention to. End of this chapter. 
Chapter 6 Another Big Customer 50% Mortality Rate You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 6 Another Big Customer 50% Mortality Rate While scrolling through my phone Above the notification bar, there are constantly prompts to add new fans and likes. Lin Rowe was slightly excited about this. No matter what netizens say, at least she has become popular, this is a real fact. Lin Ro didn't want to become an online celebrity, but it would be a good thing if she could get more business through the internet. Now she just needs to wind up an advertisement casually, and tens of thousands of netizens will immediately see it, the effect is amazing. However, Lin Ro did not do so. She knew that the reason why she had such a great popularity was all due to the accident of Zhao Xinyu last night. Although funeral parlors were originally engaged in the business of dealing with the dead. But if we were to advertise at this critical moment, it would be a bit excessive. For this reason, Lin Ro not only did not advertise, but also did not respond, allowing online discussions to develop naturally. She herself is comfortable, scrolling through one video after another. More than half an hour passed, but there was never anyone worth Lin Ro's attention. The mortality rate of most people is below 0.01%, making it almost impossible for accidents to occur. However, there was a video that caught Lin Ro's attention. Sisters, get married today. Have a banquet in the afternoon. A new year and a new beginning, I hope he and I can continue to move forward. The video is accompanied by such a copy. In the video, a newlywed couple is holding hands and smiling sweetly at the camera. A string of characters that only Lin Ro could see appeared before her eyes. Customer Zhang Tingting, ID Cute Shouting, Information The customer will die from a severe blow to the head at 8 o'clock, with a mortality rate of up to 0.2%. D.Level customers, the host can also pay attention. The system message made Lin Ro's eyes widen. According to the video, isn't 8 p.m. exactly the time for the wedding banquet? How to connect a marriage with a life in danger? This number may not seem much, but compared to other ordinary people, it is already considered a very high probability. However, Lin Ro was not surprised when she thought of the outdated customs in certain places, such as marriage disputes. She casually gave a thumbs up, wishing the newlyweds a hundred years of good marriage and also wishing them all the best. I have been watching short videos for a long time again. The probability of death for most netizens is generally less than 1%. Until an hour later, finally, a video caught Lin Ro's attention. That is a video posted by a beautiful woman with a beautiful appearance. In the video, she is wearing a JK and constantly wriggling around, with a very high number of likes. Obviously, this is a good dot looking anchor with quite a few fans. But that's not the point. Focus on the two lines of characters below. Customer Zhang Wenxian, ID Zhang Wenxian is very tired, information. Customers will be suffocated at the hotel at 10 p.m., with a 50% mortality rate. C.Level customers, hosts can pay more attention. The appearance of this news instantly made Lin Ro's spirit rise. A 50% probability. Isn't that to say, there's a 50% chance that the other party will. Although there is only a half chance of death, it is already considered very high. Lin Ro didn't even think about it. Even if a follower sends it, remember the other person's ID first. Immediately afterwards, she noticed another thing. The anchor with the ID, Zhang Wenxian is very tired, just posted a message. In the update, she stated that she will meet with the top scorer in the live broadcast room tonight, and the two will also appear together in the live broadcast room tonight. Tonight. Isn't that exactly at 10 o'clock in the evening? Lin Ro successfully found the homepage of Brother One and clicked on it to take a look. As expected. After clicking on the page of Big Brother on the leaderboard, the system's characters reappeared. Customer. 
Li Chao, ID your D Chao brother, information. The customer will be located at the hotel at 10 p.m. and will receive a heavy blow to the head, resulting in a 50% mortality rate. C. Level customers, hosts can pay more attention. Lin Ro raised her eyebrows, and it was exactly the same as she had imagined. Tonight, the female anchor named Zhang Wenxian will go to meet her chart leader. And both of them had a mortality rate of 50%, which is half and half. What does this mean? It means their meeting will definitely have an accident. And there will still be a fight where you die and I die. How could such a situation occur when a normal female anchor meets her chart leader? There must be some hidden truth behind this. However, this is not what Lin Ro is concerned about, and she doesn't have the leisure to gossip and guess what kind of relationship between those two people is. Actually, it goes without saying what will happen when a good dot looking anchor meets a top ranking guy. But it was beyond Lin Ro's expectations that it could cause human death. After some thought, she decided to remind the other party. When even sending a message in a private message, girls should not go out alone at night, otherwise, they may encounter danger. Lin Ro couldn't just say why. I can only say a few words in a private message hoping to remind the other party in this way. After all, she is not the kind of person who watches others face danger and ignores them. However, an accident occurred. After sending this private message, a red exclamation mark appeared unexpectedly. This female anchor may have been harassed by netizens too much in her daily life, so she has set permissions and needs to have a high dot level fan card to send private messages. To obtain that level of fan card, you need to brush a gift of 1,000 yuan. Lin Ro immediately felt a moment of silence. After touching the withered wallet, she chose to give up sending it directly. From the IP address, it shows that the other party's city is several provinces away from oneself, and the specific hotel system does not specify which one to stay in. It is almost impossible to remind in person. After much thought, Lin Ro eventually turned to the other person's comment section and left a comment like this. Girls go out alone at night, remember to pay attention to safety. Also, do you need to know about the one dot stop funeral service? Our store guarantees to provide you with the most satisfactory service. If you need it, you can follow your account's private message or call the 24.hour contact hotline XXXXX. After a reminder, she didn't forget to advertise for the funeral parlor. Subsequently, Lin Ro returned to the page of the top-ranked brother. Compared to that good-dot-looking female anchor, the page of the top-ranked male appears somewhat impoverished, with only over 2,000 videos having the highest views. Come to this video. Lin Ro left another similar comment and also ran another advertisement. After finishing all of this, she put down her phone and got up to move around twice. After brushing my phone for so long, my eyes are also a bit tired. I have to be busy with other things in the afternoon, but I can't just spend the whole day on my phone. However, what Lin Ro didn't know was. After she left those two comments, a large number of netizens exploded again, all of whom fell into discussion. End of this chapter Chapter 7 Full attention from the internet, Lin Ro speculates again. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 7 Full attention from the internet, Lin Ro speculates again. After Lin Ro's comments appeared in both comment sections, netizens exploded instantly. Especially on Zhang Wenxian's side. As a beautiful female anchor, how many fans does she have? After reading Lin Ro's comments, Various related likes and replies immediately appeared. Boss, your business is quite extensive. Ha ha ha, I'm going to die laughing. They just meet with their fans, so it shouldn't be so serious that they need to find a funeral parlor. I look foolish. Although Lin Ro now has 20,000 fans. But she didn't post a video on her own page, instead she left a message in someone else's video. This leads to most netizens in the comments section not knowing her, and even those who know her cannot find her here. 
therefore, many people thought she was joking. They all laughed off and didn't take it seriously. Even some people began to joke along. In the comments section of the top-ranked guy on the other side, although it's not as lively, the situation is also similar. In short, everyone thinks that Lin Ro is just joking. Some people also think that her joke is too extreme. Is it appropriate to joke about someone else's life? However, for these things, Lin Ro is naturally not valuable. After finishing lunch, she has been busy with the affairs of the neighboring Mr. Wan. Since we want to collect money from others, we definitely have to do what we need to do. As the saying goes, saving a person's life is better than building a level 7 pagoda. If possible, Lin Ro would definitely want to help others. But then again, she has already done her best. It is basically impossible to remind in person. There are several provinces separated between the two, and even if she carries the train all the way, she cannot make it. As for the alarm. That's not to mention it. Do you want to tell the police uncle that a beautiful anchor is going to meet the top male on the list, and the two of them will fight to the death in the hotel, with both sides having a 50% mortality rate and a possibility of death? Who would believe her lies? According to the system regulations, she cannot clearly disclose any information about the system, let alone reveal the cause of death of others. In this case, she can only provide subtle reminders online. Furthermore, it should be noted that even if she disregards the consequences and risks her life to reveal all the news, will anyone believe it? Others may only think she's a fool. So, this prompt is already within her capabilities. A whole afternoon. Lin Ro is basically in a working state. Occasionally, when I have free time, I brush my phone at the first time and want to choose if there is any business that can receive customers. I don't know if it's bad luck or something, but I haven't seen any netizens with a mortality rate of over 5%. Moreover, most people come from all over the world. Even if they are really unlucky and suddenly encounter difficulties, it is impossible for them to take on business. In this internet era, advanced technology connects people from all over the country. This is naturally a good thing, but currently it doesn't seem to be very helpful for Lynn Rowe's business. Unless she launches a courier funeral service, perhaps she can't say for sure. Just as Lynn Rowe kept busy with her work. The discussion about her remains undiminished. The incident where the street boy had an accident before can be said to have caused Lynn Rowe's popularity to skyrocket overnight. Even on the second day, there were still many people discussing. But compared to last night, the discussion among netizens has clearly become much more rational. Most people think that this must be just a coincidence. The comment I posted in the afternoon resulted in a car accident in the evening. What else can it be if it's not a coincidence? It's hard to say, what kind of sorcery does Lin Ro really know? That's a bit of nonsense then. Most of the fans who follow her actually have a fun watching mentality. Some are simply driven by a herd mentality, seeing others paying attention, they also pay attention to themselves. Under the bombardment of various videos in short video software. Gradually, many of them also forgot about this matter. The phrase, a funeral parlor owner who can determine life and death with just one word, has also become a humorous joke. What kind of magic, that's all fake, how can the thighs of the ladies look good? But as time passed, little by little, some netizens who have followed Lin Ro have also seen a video of Zhang Wenqian's beauty live stream. In fact, this is also very normal, after all, their fan base is just there, and it is normal for a video to exceed 1 million views. At first, netizens were simply attracted by videos. But when they clicked into the comments section, they seemed to have seen some incredible news, their eyes wide open filled with disbelief. Our store guarantees to provide you with the most satisfactory service. If you need it, you can follow our account's private message or call the 24.hour contact hotline at xxxxx. Both this advertisement and ID look so familiar. The only difference is that this is not under the video of the street bombing guy. 
but in the comments section of a female anchor named Zhang Wenxian. In an instant, countless netizens felt a tingling sensation on their scalp. Sleeping trough. Isn't that who? I have a slight impression of the funeral parlor owner who can say someone's life or death with one word. Why did you come here? Are you here to determine someone else's life or death? No way, the last one who was promoted to the funeral business seems to have already cooled down. Shouldn't this little sister also have an accident? How could it be? Last time was mostly just a coincidence, right? It's too scary. These people who know Lin Ro suddenly feel a tingling scalp and a cold spine. Even across the screen. They could all feel that this female anchor was going to have bad luck. As for the specific reason, no one can say for sure. But since the other party has been followed and commented by Lin Ro, it indicates that the matter is definitely not simple. For a moment, various comments reappeared. Some people think that Lin Ro is jealous of Zhang Wenxian receiving a large number of gifts and deliberately using a nickname to disgust others. Some people also feel that no one can say for sure about this kind of thing, and advise Zhang Wenxian to be careful. But the most common ones are still netizens who eat melons. They learned that Zhang Wenxian was going to meet with Brother Bangi tonight, and they also saw Lin Ro advertising under both sides' comment sections. One by one, they vaguely began to look forward to what would happen tonight. Even Lin Ro herself is like this. In the blink of an eye, time arrived at night. A group of netizens enthusiastically arrived at Zhang Wenxian's live broadcast room, wanting to see if it was as predicted by Lin Ro. Under the widespread attention, live streaming has also begun. End of this chapter. What are the dangers of meeting in person in Chapter 8? You are listening at NovelFull.audio. What are the dangers of meeting in person in Chapter 8? Located thousands of kilometers away in the city of Anhui. A woman dressed in heavy makeup and wearing a red mini skirt is frowning as she looks at her phone. She is Zhang Wenxian, a highly popular online beauty anchor. Since I posted a post saying that I'm going to meet with the top scorer, my fan base has been decreasing. In less than half a day, thousands of fans were lost. But Zhang Wenxian is not angry either. She knows that as long as she can comfortably serve the top-ranked brother, she can get more than a thousand fans. However, at this moment, a comment in the comments section caught her attention. Girls go out alone at night, remember to pay attention to safety. Also, do you need to know more about the one-dot-stop funeral service? The first half was quite normal, reminding her to pay attention to safety. But what about the back? Well done, why are you still promoting funeral services? Zhang Wenxian was very confused and thought she had seen ghosts in broad daylight. She thought the other person was joking. After clicking on the homepage, she found that the other person seemed to be the owner of a funeral parlor, and from the tone, it didn't seem like they were joking. Are you crazy? Didn't I just meet with Brother Bangi? What's the danger? Zhang Wenxian's face was a bit embarrassed. She turned off her phone and didn't think much. I'm about to leave soon, I don't have the heart to think about these things now. Brother Bangi is coming soon, and the top priority is to dress up quickly. She continued to apply a layer of makeup on her face. Wearing black silk and stepping on high heels that are 10 centimeters high, I am ready to go out. However, before leaving, Zhang Wenxian inexplicably remembered the message from Lin Ro. After thinking about it, she picked up a bottle of anti-wolf spray and stuffed it into her backpack before going out. After arriving downstairs. From a distance, you can see a black Land Rover already waiting. Zhang Wenxian walked naturally to the side of the car, opened the passenger door, and sat in. On the car. A man in his thirties with a bald head laughed heartily. Baby, I didn't expect you to look even better in person than in the photo. Hear this greasy sentence. Zhang Wenxian not only showed no aversion, but also smiled. Brother Chao, I spent several hours dressing up before coming out to meet you today. 
Don't treat them unfairly. Chao Gu touched her thigh without leaving any marks and continued to smile, of course, I have booked a restaurant. Let's go have a meal first. As he spoke, he started the car and prepared to depart. And Zhang Wenxian, who was sitting in the passenger seat, was not idle either. After taking out her phone, she skillfully opened the live broadcast. Good evening, fans and friends. I met with Brother Bongyi today. As the words fell, she was ready to focus the camera on Chao Gu. But how could Chao Gu possibly make himself appear in the camera? As a married man, he doesn't want his face to appear online. How can I explain if my wife sees me? So he blocked the camera and awkwardly spoke up. Cough cough. I'm driving, just live stream yourself, don't bring me along. Upon hearing this, Zhang Wenxin's face looked a bit ugly, but she also knew the reason behind it and continued to live stream on her own. I don't know if it's because of Lin Ro. Tonight's live broadcast room is particularly lively, and soon there will be tens of thousands of viewers. After seeing that Zhang Wenxian actually went to meet Brother Bangi, netizens couldn't sit still and excitedly launched barrage comments. Damn it! I actually met Big Brother. I don't know, Chan Chan is actually this kind of person. She's cleared the level. Why doesn't Brother Bang appear? I want to see how handsome he is. Don't think about the one in front, she must be very handsome, otherwise why would Chan Chan meet him? You don't understand that, right? They rely on their money skills, not their looks. Audiences, you keep talking without stopping. In no time, Zhang Wenxian lost hundreds of fans again. Zhang Wenxian also knew that she would definitely lose fans when she met with Brother Bangi, so she was not worried at all. On the contrary, there was a small portion of unique bullet comments that caught her attention. Did the anchor really meet with the top scorer? Lone men and widows, you must pay attention to safety. Beauty, you must be careful. The last person who was noticed by the funeral parlor owner died a miserable death. Miss, will there also be an accident later? Don't worry, these viewers are naturally from Lin Ro's side to watch the lively melon-eating netizens. After entering the live broadcast room, they started joking one by one. The incident of Zhao Xinyu, the young man who bombed the street last time, is still vivid in my mind. If another person dies, the situation would be a bit serious. And seeing these barrage reminders to be safe. Zhang Wenxian knows that most people have a joking mentality. I don't know why, but she had a vague sense of unease in her heart. This premonition has been present since seeing Lin Ro's barrage, and I can't explain why, but she just feels strange. Forget it, I'll go all out for the gift of brother one. Zhang Wenxian silently thought about the cableway in her heart. At the same time, she reached out and grabbed the anti-wolf spray in her backpack, which gave her a sense of security. Soon, the car arrived at the entrance of a western restaurant. After parking the car, the two of them went in to have a meal. A dinner cost over 5,000 yuan, but when the bill was settled, Chao Gu didn't even blink his eyes. Pay directly without any concern. Seeing this scene, a smile appeared at the corner of Zhang Wenxian's mouth. It's not a big deal to pay over 5,000 yuan for a meal. If you take care of your older brother and ask him to give you a gift of over 100,000 yuan, wouldn't it be easy? And she just checked online and found out that the Black Land Rover from Chaoga is priced at over 1 million yuan. This is obviously a good money owner, we must seize the opportunity to make a fortune. Zhang Wenxian pretended to play with her phone for a while and said in a sweet voice, My phone is so slow, I can't even load the barrage in the live broadcast room. I heard there's a Fruit 14 recently, I really want it. Upon hearing this, Brother Chao's face showed some dissatisfaction. Newly released Fruit 14. That thing is not cheap. He spent almost 200,000 yuan to become the top brother on the list. Do you want anything else now? You are really greedy. However, looking back at it this way, it seems that the most critical moment has arrived, 
and Chao Gu naturally won't speak his heart. He gave a lewd smile, his face twitching uncontrollably. Then he spoke up and said, no problem, I'll take you to buy a new phone tomorrow, but today, I'm a bit tired. How about we go to the hotel and rest? End of this chapter. Chapter 9 The anchor hasn't finished yet, right? You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 9 The anchor hasn't finished yet, right? Of course, Brother Chow wouldn't just buy a new phone so easily. Just kidding, I've spent so much money and it seems like I've reached a crucial point. If I still go to buy a phone, wouldn't it be a big deal? Therefore, he did not hesitate to postpone the plan to the next day. Anyway, he'll just leave early tomorrow morning. Okay, Zhang Wenxian said reluctantly. After glancing at the time, it was only after 8 o'clock, and she spoke again, isn't it too early now? Why don't we go see a movie first? Chao Gu quickly waved his hand and said, it's not early at all. Let's go rest first. I have a big deal worth millions of dollars to discuss tomorrow morning, so I need to stay energetic. Well behaved, it's not too late to take you to buy a phone when the business is settled. After all, Chao Gu is the top-ranked female anchor with extensive experience in this area. The underlying meaning of this statement is very obvious. Have fun tonight, otherwise we won't discuss the phone issue. Zhang Wenxian didn't know if the other party was deceiving her, so she reluctantly agreed. The two of them came out of the restaurant, got on the car again, and headed towards the hotel. And all of this was recorded in the live broadcast room. When they saw this, the audience couldn't calm down anymore. How long have we just met? Is the relationship progressing so fast? Shouldn't there be an accident later? Is that what Lin Ro said about the accident? Countless questions suddenly appeared in the minds of the audience. However, it seems that the two of them are getting along quite well, and it doesn't seem like there will be any unexpected situations. Under various doubts, a massive barrage of bullets appeared once again. How long have we only been together, and we're going to the hotel to rest? I envy my real name. Everyone, hurry up and watch it. Maybe the live broadcast will be gone later. TSK TSK TSK, it's tempting to watch. Shouldn't the message from the funeral parlor owner be related to this matter? But the two of them seem quite normal. Besides, Zhang Wenxian is live streaming, and even if something goes wrong, we can still know it as soon as possible. Netizens are not fools. Nature knows that the two of them have eaten their fill and are tired, so they need to go and rest. But besides envy, there's nothing to say. Also watching this live broadcast is Lin Ro. At night, there was not much work in the store. After finishing her busy schedule, Lin Ro took out her phone and started watching the live broadcast. After hearing that the two were going to the hotel, Lin Ro instinctively glanced at the time. It's already nine o'clock. According to the information provided by the system, the two will have an accident at ten o'clock, and the location of the accident is in the hotel. So far, everything is as predicted by the system, and an accident is about to happen. Lin Ro couldn't help feeling a little nervous. This is not the first time she has predicted someone else's death, let alone witnessed death. To be honest, after entering the funeral industry, she has long been accustomed to such things. Other girls may be scared and lose their face when they see an accident scene, but for Lin Ro, it feels like a common occurrence. The reason why she is so nervous is entirely due to another reason. As early as this afternoon, she knew that Zhang Wenxian was going to have an accident. Even if the mortality rate is only 50%, it is still a high probability. What is it like to witness someone else's death with one's own eyes? Anyway, it's definitely not a good thing. During this period, Lin Ro also kindly reminded a few words in the barrage. Unlike comments on short videos, her comments were quickly overwhelmed by the barrage of tens of thousands of netizens, and she couldn't even find them. She did her best, Lin Ro sighed slightly and continued watching the live broadcast. At this point, 
Zhang Wenqian and Chao Gu have already arrived at a local couple's hotel. Chao Gu arrogantly took out his bank card and opened a luxurious king-sized room. Holding the room card, we walked all the way to the sixth floor of the hotel. After arriving here, Chao Gu didn't waste any time and immediately pulled Zhang Wenqian inside. Oh, what are you doing? I haven't closed my live stream yet. Hurry up and turn it off. I've been working hard all day and I'm exhausted. I don't want to be stared at while I'm sleeping. Chao Gu rubbed his hands, looking excited and unbearable. But he was just talking, without any substantive action. After all, the live broadcast is still on, and if one's face is captured, it would be difficult to explain. Mm, but my phone is stuck and I can't even turn off the live broadcast, Zhang Wenxian said coquettishly. Even discerning people can tell that this is just farting. Can your phone get stuck so much that you can't even close the software? Obviously, it is impossible. Obviously, it's using this matter to threaten Chao Gu to buy her a new phone. Chao Gu became a bit impatient and put away the smile on his face. He was very dissatisfied and said, let's talk about it tomorrow. If it's a big deal, why don't you just shut down? Zhang Wenxian hesitated for a moment, mixed her throat, and said coquettishly. Why don't you just transfer the money to me? I'll go buy it myself. Don't worry, I'll give you the money later. I'll take a break for now, Chao said as he took his phone and turned off the live broadcast room. Zhang Wenxian originally wanted to say something, but the other party had already reached this point and couldn't do anything about it. In this way, the live broadcast room was cut off, and the audience was not sure what happened next. Ten minutes later. Chao Gu leaned against the sofa, smoking comfortably. Zhang Wenxian leaned against him, her eyes very charming. Darling, let's rest now. How about we go by a phone first? Chao Gu shook his head calmly and said, what's the rush? Where are we going? I have to talk about a big order tomorrow. Once we have a deal, I'll buy you a phone. I'll buy you one for every style. As soon as these words were spoken, Zhang Wenxian's face became somewhat cold. Since just now, Brother Chao has been procrastinating and running the train with his mouth full. It is impossible for Zhang Wenxian to say that she is not angry after so long in the past. Her originally charming gaze began to become somewhat cold, staring straight at Chao Gu. Brother Chao, you're not lying to me, are you? How could that be? They all said they would buy you a new phone tomorrow, Chao Gu replied with a smile. At this moment, Zhang Wenxian also realized that something was wrong. Just bought a phone, but ended up dragging on for so long. I definitely don't want to buy it for myself. She pushed Chao Gu away and angrily said, Don't lie to me. I've captured everything just now. Be careful, I'll show it to your wife. Chao Gu was already heavy, and was pushed so hard that he lost his balance on the spot and fell to the ground with a bang. He was also a bit annoyed by such a fall. You stinky watch, dare you hit me. End of this chapter. Chapter 10 Rest assured, the anchor is living well. You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 10 Rest Assured, the anchor is living well. After falling to the ground with a loud bang, Chao Gu was clearly annoyed. In a fit of anger, he immediately burst out and cursed. Do you dare to hit me, you stinky watch? Do you want to die? Pooh, it was clearly you who deceived me first. Give me your phone. I won't give it, I want to send the video to your wife to watch. Hurry up and give it to me. The two began to argue. Under the argument, the conflict also began to escalate, and the two of them chose to take action one after another. Brother Chao is fat and heavy. In comparison, how could Zhang Wenxian be his opponent? In no time, Zhang Wenxian was pinned to the bed by the other party, unable to move. However, even so, she is still struggling desperately. Let go of me, otherwise I'll post the video online. Originally, the two were just competing for phones. 
After hearing this threat, Chao Ji's face completely changed. He slapped him fiercely as if he had been provoked. At the same time, he grabbed the pillow tightly and covered it tightly, seemingly intending to cover the person to death. The strong suffocation directly made Zhang Wenxian dumbfounded. In a hurry, she remembered the anti-wolf spray she carried when she went out, and took it out of her backpack. After two sprays of spray, Brother Chow covered his eyes in agony. Are you spraying me in the eye? After cursing a few words, he continued to plan to take action. However, Zhang Wenxian has already been scared silly. In a state of urgency, she didn't care much anymore. Seeing an ashtray on the table next to him, he grabbed it and threw it at the other person's head. Bang! The ashtray accurately hit the back of the opponent's head, and the noisy sound came to an abrupt end. At this point, Zhang Wenxian was completely frightened. For some reason, a sentence suddenly popped up in her mind. It was Lin Rose's comment below her comment section. The message, originally thought to be a joke, now seemed like a spell that lingered in her mind for a long time. After a long pause, she picked up her phone on the ground and made a trembling call. I, I need to report to the police. I seem to have killed someone. On the internet. After Zhang Wenxian's live broadcast was cut off, netizens also guessed what was going to happen next. Anyway, it's definitely not suitable for content that happens in a live broadcast room. Therefore, although they left the live broadcast room, the discussion never ended. After watching the live broadcast, the discussion not only did not decrease, but also increased. Why did Chan Chan drop the broadcast so early today? She went to see Brother One on the leaderboard. She was still live streaming just now, but when she entered the hotel, it was dropped. What? She was just live streaming. That's good, it shows she's quite safe. How to say this? Is Zhang Wenxian in any danger? You haven't heard of it yet, have you? There's a funeral parlor owner promoting services in Zhang Wenxian's comment section, thinking she might have an accident. Which funeral parlor owner is so unethical? He came here to do business. Most netizens focus on the big brother on the list. I have already started brainstorming the scene and scene of the two meeting. A small group of people also heard about Lin Ro's situation and began to inquire curiously. Of course. There are also many fans of Lin Ro who are paying attention to this matter. When Lin Ro saw Zhang Wenxian and Brother Bangyi live streaming sweetly, and later entered the hotel, her fans were somewhat disappointed. This is different from what I thought. The two of them can't possibly encounter danger at the hotel, can they? It seems that Zhao Xinyu, the spiritual young man last time, was mostly just a coincidence. Isn't that right, so what am I really looking forward to? I'm not sure either. Don't think about it. After meeting with Brother Bangyi, Zhang Wenxian went to the hotel to rest, which must be very safe. After all, they don't kill like Zhao Xinyu, running to the streets and bombing them in the middle of the night. If even staying in a hotel is dangerous, who dares to stay in a hotel? In this situation, although they were grateful that Zhang Wenxian had not had any problems, they couldn't help but feel a little disappointed. I thought I could witness the occurrence of supernatural events with my own eyes. I've been working on it for a while, and the last incident was just a coincidence. But it's also. How could Lin Ro, a funeral parlor owner, really have the ability to predict death? Just as netizens keep discussing. On the other hand, Lin Ro's heart was not at all calm. She knew that the predictions given by the system were impossible to make mistakes. Although the two of them closed the live broadcast after entering the hotel. But it's obvious that something must have happened in the hotel. Lin Ro is not sure exactly what it is. Both Zhang Wenxian and the top-ranked brother have a mortality rate of 50%. What does this mean? It means they must have had an accident. And it's still a very serious kind, otherwise two people wouldn't have had an accident at the same time. As for whether it can survive, 
the probability given by the system is half and a half, and Lin Ro cannot say for sure. She originally intended to report to the police. But during the live broadcast, it was possible that Chao Gu was worried about being caught cheating by his wife, so he was careful not to disclose the specific address, only knowing that they had gone to a hotel located on the sixth floor of a certain hotel. Forget it, I've done everything I need to do. Whether you live or die depends on your luck. Lin Ro silently thought to herself. She didn't plan to stay in the funeral parlor as it was getting late. After locking the storefront door, I prepared to take a walk home as usual. Returned to his own small room. Although the area is not very large, it is incredibly comfortable to live in. And located on the 20th floor, standing on the balcony, you can overlook the entire coastal city. When she is idle and bored on weekdays, Lin Ro likes to stay here and enjoy the scenery, and her childhood is incredibly comfortable. Anyway, as the owner of a funeral parlor, working overtime during 996 is something that doesn't exist for her, so it must be how comfortable she feels. After taking a shower, Lin Ro glanced at the time. It's already past 11 in the evening. If nothing unexpected happens, there should be an accident on Zhang Wenxian's side she took out her phone and originally wanted to check if there were any relevant news. But a phone call happened to come over. Hello Aunt Chen, what's up? The person on the other side of the phone is called Aunt Chen, a loyal customer of Lin Ro. I called late at night, but I don't know what it was. Xiao Bai, could you help me deliver some paper money tomorrow? Thank you. Upon hearing this, Lin Ro immediately agreed. That's right. Her funeral parlor also offers takeout services. It's just not food, but some funeral supplies. Whether it's an urn or a ghost coin, as long as you give enough money, it can all be delivered to your doorstep. After all, in these days, no industry is easy to operate, and the same goes for funerals. To attract more customers, it is natural to offer some high dot quality services. After hanging up the phone, end of this chapter.